Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm going to be giving you a tour of all of the artwork that I created throughout the month of March as part of my 365 day art challenge. I was going back home to Scotland for a couple of weeks towards the end of the month and I knew that I was going to be very busy so I wanted to make simple drawings that I could create with a limited amount of art supplies. In the end I decided to draw robots because I've always really liked robots and I felt that they would be quite easy to draw because they're made up of very simple shapes. I'm going to be making a video showing all of the art supplies that I took home with me so if you're interested in seeing that then please subscribe if you haven't already and if you hit the bell button next to the subscribe button then you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. For these pictures I started out by creating a rough sketch using a colour race pencil and then once I was happy with the shape I outlined it with a black fine line pen. I then used Copic markers to create a base layer of grey which I layered on top of again with blue and red colour race pencils. Some days I added another layer with a mechanical pencil, some days I skipped this step and then I added the finer details with my fine line pen. To finish off I used Tombow dual brush pens to add an extra pop of colour and a little more colour race pencil if it had worn off as I worked. On day 66 I drew a celebration bot, celebrating the fact that I had only 299 days left to go out of my 365 day art challenge. It really felt great counting down from having 300 and something days left to go to having 200 and something days left to go. My favourite drawing of the month was actually the two day series showing the robot receiving a parcel which on the second day turned out to contain a baby robot. The baby robot became a recurring character and appeared a few times over the course of the month. I also really liked the picture near the end of the month that shows the baby robot with the robot puppy. It was a challenge creating pictures with just the supplies that I could fit into a pencil case, but I liked how quick the pictures were to create in comparison to the previous month when I was spending several hours on each piece. These generally took about an hour and a half per drawing, which was much better when I was travelling, especially since I had to cross 11 time zones going from Melbourne to Scotland and 9 time zones travelling back after the clocks had changed. I would definitely recommend limiting your art supplies and trying a simplified drawing style if you want to create quicker art. One of the hardest things as always was trying to decide what to draw each day. I knew that I was drawing robots so that at least helped to narrow it down a bit but I still needed to come up with a prop, a costume, a different style of robot or to place them in a different situation to make each picture unique. Some days ideas will come more quickly to you and other days it takes a bit more time to think of something. Every now and then you might think of an idea that you don't want to use on a particular day and I found it useful to keep those ideas in mind for future use. It can be helpful to create a document for yourself with random words that you can use as prompts for the days that you feel stuck and I've been using some apps and websites to generate prompts for myself at times as well. Let me know if you would like to see a video about my tips for generating prompts for art challenges. As always, I'm posting my pictures every day over on my Instagram account so if you're not already following me there and you want to keep up to date with what I'm doing on a day-to-day -day basis, then you can head over there and follow me. I'll also be posting videos like this every month to give you a bit of a more detailed look at each of my drawings. 
Hopefully April's video won't be quite as delayed as this one has been. This month I've gone back to doing slightly longer pictures and I've been working on a dragon theme which is something else that I've wanted to try drawing more. I'm planning on doing mermaid next month so if any of you are planning to participate in that as well then please let me know in the comment section below. So that's it for this video. I really hope that you enjoyed seeing all the artwork that I produced last month. If you did, then please give this video a thumbs up and let me know which was your favourite robot drawing. Thanks again so much for watching and I'll see you all again very soon. Bye everyone!